Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as you can see, Microsoft has announced the next generation of OneDrive, calling it OneDrive Home. And this is something I mentioned at the beginning of September, where they had confirmed AR and new features will be coming to OneDrive. And um, they had confirmed they would hold a OneDrive online event on the 3rd of October, which was yesterday in my region. And just to go through some of these uh, new enhancements and changes, if you are using OneDrive and with this announcement, um, like all things Microsoft now, they are integrating AR, artificial intelligence, a lot more now into the new OneDrive home in the future. Now, personally, I think one or two of these uh, new changes have been a long time coming. Um, I do use OneDrive currently on a day-to-day -day basis, so personally, I'm, I am happy to see one or two of these changes. And just to focus on some of the key highlights, if you would be interested and are using OneDrive, First of all, OneDrive Home has been redesigned, as we can see, which Microsoft says will help you uh, retrieve your files no matter where they live in your organization. There's also a new uh, For You, and this section at the top of the OneDrive homepage surfaces AR-powered file recommendations. So, as mentioned, AR is going to be integrated quite a lot now in the future. There's a new uh, Meetings view that shows your upcoming and past meetings along with meetings a meeting recordings and shared files. You can see we've got a people view. There's also a shared view. So any file that's been shared with you now shows up in the shared view. And something I'm personally happy to see roll out is colorful folders. So we're not just getting the yellow folders that are currently available. We're getting colored and colorful fol folders, which I think is, an, is a long time coming just to help you organize your folders. So I'm personally happy to see that roll out. Um, yeah, we get favorites where you can mark any file as a favorite and access it from your favorites list across OneDrive, Teams, File Explorer, Microsoft 365, apps, and so on. Uh, there's also shortcuts for quick access to files shared with you. And we also get a simplified sharing. So sharing files and copying links, um, according to Microsoft, um, it will involve a lot less clicks. So simplified file sharing is, is also um, coming. And these changes I've just mentioned and improvements should start becoming available quite soon. And um, when it comes to features rolling out in the next couple of months by December, um, those would include options and an option to open any file in the desktop app, edit it and have changes synced to OneDrive, which will be available as mentioned by December. And also in December, Microsoft will be adding OneDrive to Teams and Outlook. So if you are using OneDrive and also are using Teams and Outlook, I think that would be a nice move in the right direction. Now, next year, starting in early 2024, they're going to be introducing files on demand for the web version of OneDrive. And um, Microsoft says regarding uh, files on demand, um, when you want files and folders available for offline access on your device, just select them to be always available locally directly from OneDrive for web. And we also have offline mode, which is going to be rolling out uh, in early 2024, which is also something I am quite happy uh, to see. Um, having access to your files offline, which I think will be a nice move. And then as mentioned, um, Microsoft is going to be integrating AR. So uh, Copilot in OneDrive is going to become available uh, by December. And that's if you are a Microsoft 365 have subscribers. So if you're a customer who has a Microsoft 365 Copilot license now, um, that's going to be rolling out to OneDrive and also be coming to SharePoint. So you can do things like ask questions related to an individual file or get a summary of the content as mentioned. And you can do this um, without opening the file. So you can actually use um, the Copilot to access and open files without clicking on it. And Copilot in OneDrive will become available as mentioned by December if you have a Microsoft 365 Copilot license. So that's just a brief overview of OneDrive Home. And as mentioned, some of these uh, new enhancements and improvements and changes will be rolling out soon and others we're going to have to wait until December and early next year 2024. But I'll keep you posted and let you know as this happens. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.